Hello everybody, this is Drew Naylor, and wait, where's my microphone? Oh, there it is. Um, this is Drew Naylor, and um, I'm I'm probably not going to edit this video, but um, I wanted to make an update about another Ethernet cable that I accidentally broke the clip on. Uh, this one is from, I think it's from either my router or my cable modem. Either way, I was taking it out of a box and I pushed down on the little clamp thing right here and it accidentally broke just now. Several minutes ago, it just pushed, I pushed down on it and it went click and it broke apart. It's supposed to look like this. supposed to look like that. I think even this one is kind of close to breaking, breaking apart. I'm probably going to be trimming my fingernails soon, within the next day or two. Um, but yeah, I broke another Ethernet cable uh, clamp thing by accident. It doesn't really matter because it can it still works. You can just plug it into whatever you need, except it can easily fall out. So that's the only drawback with um, using an Ethernet cable that's not 100% uh, mechanically operational. Um, but yeah, I don't actually use this phone. I replace it with a Monoprice Cat 6 cable. I don't even know what cable this is. It doesn't have anything on it at all. No, no printing anywhere. Maybe it says somewhere in here. No, I highly doubt it. Anyway, it does actually kind of look like one of Monoprice's cables, but it has no printing on it. So it makes me wonder if maybe they requested no printing on one of Monoprice's cables just to not have it say Monoprice and it didn't come with any printed anything on it. Um, I've heard that Monoprice's cables, uh, Ethernet cables will occasionally not actually have the, if you request no um, logo on it or something like that. It won't have any information about what kind of cable it even is. I've heard in some reviews on Monoprice's website. So, um, yeah, that's kind of weird that it doesn't even say what it is. But, um... Yeah, I actually... Like I said earlier, I don't even use this cable. It's just... It was kind of sitting in a box and I decided to pull it out and I pushed down on the little plastic thing and it broke so i guess that's all i need to say for this video um probably not going to edit this because it's just so short i can like upload it straight from my phone now because i actually have a platform that google wants to support um yeah so goodbye for now